Brown from Canis Chiropractic, your Boulder Mary chiropractor. Today we're here with Kristen, and Kristen, this is her first adjustment ever. She's never been to a chiropractor before, and she's been having pain in her neck and her mid-back and her low back and all kinds of stuff. Kristen, tell them what's going on. Hello, this is my very first time. I have a lot of back issues, neck issues, and so I'm ready to feel better. What? Why you have all this pain? Um, I guess years of bad posture, driving, um, I've been in maybe three car accidents, so all, all, right. all of that. So uh, Kristen was already on electrical stim, we use that to help relax the muscles. We found a lot of misalignments in her spine, so I'm just going to show you how we do a good old full spine adjustment. We're going to adjust her neck, her mid back, and her low back, and she's been also having pain in her elbow, so I'm going to adjust around her elbow. She's got a little inflammation over the... Uh, lateral aspect of the elbow, a little bit of what's called tennis elbow, lateral epicondylitis, so we're going to help to get her feeling better with that too. So the first thing we're going to have her do is you're going to have her lay down on your stomach for me. She's a little nervous, but no need to be nervous. Okay, and you can see, you know, when we laid her down earlier, we saw that. You can see her right leg short here, so her pelvis is definitely off kilter. So we're going to adjust a lot of stuff on her because she's pretty out of whack. So I already felt her spine, I already palpated her spine, and what we were feeling with for, we're feeling for tightness in certain areas, things different on one side of the spine compared to the other, making sure the vertebrae are moving well, and she had a lot of restriction, a lot of knots, a lot of big sore, right? Yeah. So we're going to adjust her. Now, Kristen, when I adjust you, you're going to hear some pops or cracks, oh. doesn't hurt, everything feels really good. So what I want you to do is I want you to drop your arms down. And what we're doing when we do this adjustment is we're realigning everything and getting mobility into the joints. By getting motion into the joints, this is going to help to free everything up. You feel bad like I told you because everything's being compressed and tight and jammed up. So this is going to help to release that, okay? Mm -hmm. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to adjust you in your mid-back. You're going to take a deep breath in. You're going to blow it out. I'm going to push down gently, okay? Mm -hmm. Not going to hurt. All right. So take a deep breath in. Blow it all the way out. Just kind of relax your back. Good. Good. Not bad, right? Mm -hmm. Kind of feel good in a weird way? Feels really good. Okay, flip on your back for me. Now we're going to adjust your neck. Want me to flip? I want you to flip on your back, yeah? Okay. And here, scoot back a little bit for me. Yep, right there. So, we'll adjust your neck. You might hear a little pop or crack. It'll help to release everything. It's going to feel real good. Okay. So just all you can do is just relax your head. Ooh. Good. Feel okay? Mm-hmm. Felt good. Good. And let's do this side. Mm. Wow, that was good. <laughs> My up cracks. Does that feel good to pull it? Mm-hmm. This will help to kind of just open it up and decompress it. And the next thing we're going to do is we're going to adjust your, um, your low back and your hips. So I want you to lay on your side and face me this way. <laughs> I should lift my legs. Yeah, you're going to bend your leg like this. And you're going to get you in some weird position. Grab your elbows real tight. Scoot you up through me. So look, you're not going to fall. You might feel like you're going to fall. Nobody's falling yet. You won't be the first. <laughs> so we're going to adjust this. And this is all tight in here. So this is going to help to adjust and realign the hips and the pelvis. So all you're going to do is kind of lay here. Just let your body kind of twist. Just relax. Ooh. Good. You feel all that? And adjust Flip it. Flip on the other side. Yeah. That felt good, right? That felt really good. good. And now we're going to adjust your other side of the low back. Scoot toward me. Grab the elbows. Kind of just put this back. Okay. I'm just going to let this twist. Just relax your hips. Good. Feel that? Mm -hmm. Good. Sit up for me. Okay. Stand up for a sec. Kind of, kind of move around. Alright. Alright. And what I want you to do is I want you to lay back down. I want to make sure that everything's straight. So lay yourself back down. Let's make sure your hips and your pelvis and everything are in alignment. Oh yeah, you can see it's perfectly straight. So that's good. I don't know if you can see this, but feet are perfectly balanced. Everything's back in alignment, so that's good. All right, sit up for me. We're going to check this elbow. How should I sit? Just face me. Push up a little This one. Okay. So she was having pain on her elbow. Um, I was going to show you on a picture, but you feel that? Mm-hmm. Feel that like crunchy stuff? Yep. That shouldn't be there. That's coming because that could have been pain. Well, because it's ten. You know, it's it's got some swelling and some inflammation in here. Okay. And when this gets tight, this kind of restricts this elbow from moving. So we're gonna use this instrument. That's not gonna hurt at all. 
and this will help to break up some of the tightness in here. And we'll see what happens with this elbow. If this elbow still stays tight and still stays restricted, we can um, always do what's called dry needling, and those are needles that we can put in there to help relax it. Mm -hmm. And what this does, this high velocity thrust into the tendon will help to break up the receptors that are keeping this joint tight. Mm -hmm. So this will help to relax it. And you'll be pleasantly surprised, but this will, this will really make your elbow feel a lot better. Okay, good, very simple. Mm -hmm. So, how'd that feel? It felt really good. No pain, you were no nervous, pain. shouldn't have been nervous, yeah, right? I shouldn't have been nervous. Easy. Okay, so this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna put Kristen on, uh, we have a table, a traction table, which will help to get some mobility to the joints. We're gonna do some things to help strengthen her spine, to help hold the, um, vertebra in a good position. Now that she's been adjusted, things are where they should be. We want to make sure that that stays in that position. So that's it. And we're going to see her a few times a week for the next few weeks and she should be good and we'll take it from there. Everybody, thanks for joining. I appreciate it. Go to my YouTube channel. Please subscribe. And remember, pain's not a lifestyle. We'll see you next Friday for another video. Have a good one.